because of this greed that we have for material and we are striving for that day and night we are working hard and then uh, the second universal mistake happen in our life which is uh, the people work on the matter the you know so all our energies we're going to spend for the uh, collection of this material you know because we have uh, you know in our heart and mind we have this feelings desires so obviously our amal will be the same you know allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is telling us amanu wa amilu salihat so what we should have we should have a right faith and then we should strive for that but here is something again a mistake that we have a different desire and we are striving for the same mistake that we are uh, uh, doing every possible um, you know effort to get this material so if you really look into that the whole world you will realize how many people are trying to um, you know uh, do efforts and trying to gain those resources for spirituality you know so this is um, uh, efforts for the material versus efforts for the spirituality so now the efforts for spirituality is something we need to understand you know because what is spirituality spirituality is your inside feelings for allah subhanahu wa ta'ala it's just like if someone said loved one so loved one means they are their relatives and they have a love for each other you know relative is is a is a legal uh, you know relation because a father and son they are legally bound it is on their birth certificate you know regardless of what they do they cannot delete the father name from their birth certificate so this is a legal um, you know relation but is this relation has a love or not you know two brothers they have a legal relation sisters they have a relation but do they have a, a true love for each other or not so sometime uh, when people they displease each other this love diminished or vanished so this is something uh, we need to understand you know the love is very important uh, if there is no love between the relatives you know still they are relatives you know we are makhluk and allah is khaliq you know we still have a relation of creator and creation you know but do we have uh, uh, with feelings this relation or not certain times we are doing some actions but those actions are only actions they don't have feelings into that you know for example if someone giving the gifts to to their friends and families you know so they are giving the gifts are they giving really with the feelings they really want to please others they really want to get their love and you know uh, their feelings too or if it's not then it's like um, putting others down or they are showing off or it's like a purposeless exchange of gifts these days it's very common oh they gave this much to on my um, you know um, they they gave us this gift now we have to give it doesn't matter you know i have or not or whatever in my situation my feeling is not same but still i have to do it you know so this kind of exchange of gift is not really having a true value you know and even when you have a, a small gift you know just like a flower but you have a feelings into that then this flower values a lot so this is something spirituality that inside we are praying to allah subhanahu wa taala you know but uh, praying is a mandatory uh, if there is a feelings behind that or oh, since i born muslim i have to pray you know so especially the young people parents are pushing them to pray you know they are pushing them to do the good deeds you know so they are then this this is a young man he just doing it because he is getting forced by his parents but if he has his own relation that makes a big difference so that kind of spirituality we need to seek and we 
which is a desire, which is something missing right now all over in the community. So we are uh, really doing all our efforts uh, for the material. You know, one was first mistake was uh, we have desires. Number two, we are making all the efforts, not the efforts to get the spirituality. You know, so if you look into that, seventy-five thousand students are studying in one university. What they want to gain over there? They want to get some kind of degrees and the, then they want to make the money. Why these young people are not spending their time to read the Quran and get the meanings and the depth of the Quran and they get the connection with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So this is something is missing right now. All the inventions right now going on to make uh, more you know, money and uh, having more production of you know, fruit and vegetables and more um, you know, uh, luxury uh, things and all this is um, day by day, all this work is going on and this is to gear towards, you know, to have improvement of material. I wish we have sit down and think about is my Salat is really valuable Salat. If my Salat is at, it costs some, some value, you know, I, how I can increase more is by Hushu and Khuzu. You know, we should have more feelings into this Salat. It's the same two rakat or four rakat of Salat, but the value will increase. There are different ways to increase the value. One is your heart. Other is your taqwa. You know, when you are fearful, uh, having fear of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in your life, this Salat will have a more and more value. That means you have a more and more connection with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This Salat will have a more value to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This is something we are uh, really missing. There are certain things, they are very costly, a very heavy uh, in weight and in uh, their price. And, and um, you, you know, uh, if you look into a diamond, it's a small stone, but it uh, value a lot. You know, I wish we should have our prayers, our uh, feelings, our, uh, you know, all uh, ibadah should be value something like that you know uh, that uh, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept that Allah get happy with that so this is a universal mistake going on uh, right now everywhere every part of the world every age uh, men and women you know in all sense you know uh, people are uh, yes praying people are doing good deeds as a generally as a Muslims Yes, we are doing all these things, but we are not connected with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala spiritually with our feelings. You know, we count, but we really don't have, you know, it's like we have a quantity and we don't have the quality right now. This is something uh, universally, you know, a mistake is going on. And uh, it's not only our relation with Allah, same thing our relation with the Rasulullah, same thing our relation with the uh, you know, all the pious people, ulama, mashayikh, and similarly with the Quran and uh, Baytullah and Masajid and you name it, all the religious things, you know, our uh, depth of relation is missing. You know, this is something we need to rebuild. Our elders used to love Quran. You know, when they touch Quran, they kiss them, they, they uh, almost hug them and they, they keep this in with respect. Today, children are carelessly touching the Quran. You know, they're reading the Quran and they are not going into the meanings and depth of the Quran. You know, they are praying towards Baitullah, but they are also sitting and facing their feet towards Baitullah. So these are kind of mistakes happening because missing is spirituality. I wish we can think about and reconnect ourselves with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah give us the, the chance to really improve from this universal mistake.